you look for people. Try and I like that. Dimensions, you, you need to have that. Yeah. Well, I think what comes to mind immediately is, first of all, obviously you're looking for academically excellent people. That's the first thing. But secondly, and equally important, you look for passionate people. So I think this is the combination uh, I think I, I'm typically looking for. Passion for research, for the field, for working in an academic environment on one hand, but on, of course combined with academic excellence. Problem solving skills. I mean, people who are immediately intrigued by a problem and have kind of the itch to try and solve it and potentially draw, try to think out of the box, drag every bit of knowledge they have on the table to try and solve the problem. I like that. And, and that, that automatically brings some creativity. And then in terms of pure technical skills, I prefer to hire people that at least have a, a bit of programming and software writing skills because that also shapes the way you think, it help you think in algorithms in, and it also helps in, in the problem solving skills. I think that that's my experience. Yeah, okay. I think first of all, um, they should be very passionate about research, eager to learn. I think that's also a very important quality and, and be a team player and be very communicative. I think those are the, the important aspects I'm looking for, much more than background knowledge. Of course, background knowledge is also important, yeah. but these are things you can learn on the job. The other things that I mentioned, you can't really learn. You, you need to have that. Yeah.